Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of The Road Tour, and we are checking things out right now. Yes, going to kind of see uh, what's going on here. It's a pretty good uh, parcel area of land. What is this flapping thing here? What the world is this? Land security plant. Well, that's pretty cool. Look at that. I like that. Nice open uh, layout they have for the land. Pretty level. Overlooking the water. Well, the land before the water, that is. This kind of house looks familiar. I know this is a... Uh, inverse house um i've got a lot of inverse houses in my inventory oh my god let's see what we have here it's a nice couch i like the setup of that let's come on inside and see what we got here we got a door that yeah, we can make it in very nice Oh, wow. So we got going here. What is this? Ironing board? Kitchen. Is that like a dishwasher? Must be the fridge, right? Oh, there's nothing. Wait, what is this? It's an onion bowl. I'll eat an onion. Well, I like how they have all the plants set up. The cactuses. The various house plants. This is nice. That's actually not bad for a house plant. Uh, one prim. You know, they look pretty decent, too. I know I've always had to hunt for really nice looking house plants that were not extremely high prim. These look really nice. Very nice. Come in here. This is. Ooh, look at this. Oh, I like how they have the curtains done here. Look at this. Okay, that's something. Change the textures on them, right? That's a nice, cozy atmosphere to it. Let's come on upstairs and see what's going on up here. What kind of magic they got going on. There's nothing bad or weird. I don't think so. Looks pretty good. Look at that. Oh. What the fuck? I like how the bathroom is done. Just kind of a... Uh, they, they did their own texture here for the bathroom, too, it looks like. Well, maybe. Look at this. That's a nice looking uh, bathroom set up there. Side. Oh, wait. We have. What? What the? Why do we have two toilets? Or wait, is that like a sink? That must be like a inside bathroom. What the? Okay, that's. I don't know. That's. That's not a sink. Could be something for rinsing, like a like a bidet type of thing. I guess out here we have a patio <laughs> with a door. I need to open the door. Let's see what we have here. Not a huge patio as far as space goes, but it does work. Gets the job done. Yeah, not a bad place, guys. Kind of cool. Here, let's take a little stroll around the property. See what we have out here in some of the corners. Oh, we have a secret little bed area. Some lamps out here. Cute little patio mat. I like a cute little patio mat, don't you guys? Of course you do. 
come over here. We'll see where we're at. Oh. Nice deck. I like the setup on that. It looks pretty cool. Yeah, there's so many things to see, guys, just along the road. And, you know, if people don't have security orbs up, you know, I understand why they do. But it's kind of nice, you know, when they don't have security orbs, and especially those god-awful band lines. <clears throat> to let other people come in and see their creativity and how they did things. You know, I've said this a million times already, but... You can get so many ideas when you actually see it in the world and how it's set up. You can be like, man, okay, that, that's cool. I'm going to go find this object. In my opinion, this also helps some of the people that create and build things to get more traffic for people to buy those things. Because like, you come out and you see that landscaping or those trees or that building or those objects or furniture utilized in a place and you can see it utilized not just on demonstration right but actually utilized in someone else's build i can't think of how many things that i have bought specifically because i have come out and seen how people have used different you know objects items whatever they might be in their particular build you know that makes a big difference to see how it's being utilized and actually uh, get an idea how you can apply it on your build and how that's going to work. So, anyways, hope you guys keep them safe out there. And I'm going to go and vet some other areas out here for the next episode of the Road Tour. So, you guys keep safe, and I'll see you next time around. Peace.